A special magic takes over New York City at Christmas time, drawing people from around the world wanting to experience the sights and sounds up close. But for those who live or work here, the influx of visitors can turn them into sidewalk scrooges. First of all, if you're a tourist, don't start taking pictures and uh, walking slow. You gotta walk fast, people are going to work. But they bump into you and they seem like they lost. The tourists walk five in a row. So they block the sidewalk. The city is experiencing a record number of tourists this year, and an estimated 5 million will visit between Thanksgiving and New Year's alone. You should be happy that people are coming from different countries. You should be proud that so many people want to come here and look at your beautiful city. It's not that these Grinches don't like visitors. They just have no patience for their lack of sidewalk etiquette. The biggest offenders? The cell phone talker. Awestruck sightseers with cameras. The tour group that sticks together no matter what the window shoppers. New Yorkers have some advice for them. I would just say kindly move to the side and let the New Yorkers that are in a rush, you know we're a hustle and bustle city, get by and go where we need to get. A little more courteous sometimes. They're so, you know, I understand they're excited, it's a big city, but at the same time they just need to be more, I guess, cognizant of their surroundings because it's very difficult to walk for the everyday New Yorker. I think that visitors can navigate the sidewalks better by understanding that New Yorkers need to get somewhere in a hurry. Um, and by politely moving out of the way if they're lost. So, depending on your perspective, the holidays may not be the most wonderful time of the year. Warren Levinson, Associated Press, New York.